Level by Level Gaming and this is going to be a video on a problem that I've had with the PAPK3 Plus, the new 16 gigabyte version and that's going to be some people are having some problems um, bricking their device and I'm just going to go a little bit into that real quick. So you have my original menu that I wrote for the 4 gigabyte version of the device and if you try to install that on the new 16 gigabyte with the B version of the chipset, it will not boot up. Um, technically, you've not bricked your device. It is salvageable, and that's the beauty of the way these things are designed. All you have to do is flash the original image uh, stock firmware back on to the device. But here is the problem, and this is what I wanted to talk about and highlight just for a moment. And that's if you look here... Um, this person had sent me a uh, comment on my YouTube channel, Level by Level Gaming, and they said that they had bricked their device. I asked them about it. Oh, no, you bricked it. And they said, basically, after some correspondence, um, and this is something that's happened with quite a few people, is they try to put the 16 gigabyte version of the, or the 4 gigabyte version of the menu onto the 16 gigabyte device and they did not have a original firmware um, so I'm gonna reiterate please by all means guys if you go in my videos here you will see that I have a video that is all about cloning your SD card so you can back it up and reinstall it these devices um, unlike some phones um, and other things that I've messed with in the past other devices some things once you brick them they are hard bricked uh, and you might as well throw them in the trash with this thing if you mess it up all you have to do is get an original back on the SD card and it should fire right back up and the best way to do that is to clone your SD card so please go back and watch this so you don't have those problems but um, the thing that I'm seeing quite a bit is that people aren't backing up and cloning it and they need a copy of the original so uh, that's the case with, uh, let's see here, on the Dingunity topics or forum board, this person had attempted to put uh, my mod on there. That's exactly what happened to them. They had the 16 gigabyte, they put the 4 gigabyte menu on there and it wouldn't start back up. And um, this person right here, this is somebody I've been corresponding with. I'm just showing you guys examples of this happening. In fact, this person even sent me an image and was like, hey, my thing comes on and all I'm getting is a green light here and a blank screen. So um, this is an example of somebody that I believe did not have an original to flash back on there. And so is this person here. Um, and after getting several request for the custom in image or not the custom image but the stock image a backup of it because hey accidents happen we're all human and sometimes we just jump right into something we don't think to go in here and to um, make a clone of their SD card like this right here so what I've done is I've went on to Frostwire here and I've created a uh, link so right now I have two people that are downloading this or two seeds um, I know ex one of these people is somebody I'm in direct correspondence with that really just desperately wanted the stock image and couldn't find it anywhere so um, I'm gonna take and I'm gonna copy this link here and I'm going to paste this link to download this in the descriptions in this video so if you don't have Frostwire it's free um, it's a peer-to-peer -to -peer torrent type sharing service uh, whenever you go to download this thing um, if you don't have it already it'll give you some prompts I'm not gonna go all the way through re-downloading this but it'll give you some prompts don't install anything additional that it asks you to install um, sometimes it'll ask you to install 
browser plugins and antivirus and I've seen all kinds of stuff pop up as additional downloads just hit decline 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 on all that stuff and just get the core Frostwire download you can even customize it while you're going through it just be smart about it and when you're using Frostwire be smart about that too um, you can find a lot of stuff in here whenever you search but um, this is the link that I'm going to put and share. I'm going to leave this up and running um, and try to get some enough of it out there that if somebody needs it, they have it available. And also, if you look in the Dingunity boards, um, I've placed this link in there also. And I've placed it in several other posts that are related to the PAP. Uh, K3 plus just because I want to make it available to you guys so if you're in the boat where these people have found themselves and you are desperately looking for the original stock firmware to flash back onto your device and you need to know how to do it um, just check out this video and the link in the description and the Dingunity boards and you should be able to get your device back up and running if you have I'm gonna call it soft bricked it where you put an image on there that doesn't work and you just did not you forgot or didn't know that you needed to clone your original um, SD card image all right well this has been level by level gaming and I hope this is able to help somebody and if you haven't please subscribe hit the like button if you like my videos and continue watching for more retro game and PAP action